Food for Thought Volume 2. Protein. And how to get protein when you can't really find protein or protein is limited scarce. How to get the most protein out of your everyday meal or at the time when the shit hits the fan or limited supply of protein. I suggest protein powders, whey powders, and other fine bodybuilding type of powders like mass gainers and other source of uh, protein. This is just only in case of an emergency. Mass gainers are very cheap right now still. So if you stock up on some mass gainer, you will be on uh, be, be well off because mass gainer will build mass, also has a high amount of protein in it, and also it has vitam uh, vitamins and minerals and everything else to get you going. And then other things you can do is taco meat in a can. Pace makes a good taco meat in a can. That's still around. A lot of people don't like it, but it still tastes pretty good when you uh, want a taco night or something. Uh, it's not the best taco night. You, you know, get to always get the uh, beef and put it into a skillet and have your own taco seasoning. But if worse comes to worse and have no power, taco meat in a can can save the day. So taco meat in a can, you got your whey powder, you just need a little bit of water, um, and then just shake it up and then have a blender bottle. Make sure you have a, a nice sturdy blender bottle. That's what you need in a lot of things. You can get a blender bottle for like 3 to $4 or $2 at Walmart. On Walmart.com, you can go there. Get a blender bottle and then just blend it all together and just chug it down and then you have your um, your protein or you can sip it, whatever you want to do with it. Uh, you can also get uh, fiber, uh, psyllium fiber. Make sure you don't like, like hold psyllium fiber. Make sure you put enough water in there because you don't want it the thing to gel up and bind in your system. But then you'll have a blockage in your intestine where they have to do surgery. So what you do is just a little scoop of psyllium fiber, just a tiny scoop, and a little bit of water, and maybe yeah, not a little bit, but some water. Make sure it's liquefied, and then gulp the stuff down. I usually gulp it down, and then it expands in your belly and makes you feel fuller. And then you can take uh, the the um, mass gainer in that type of situation, or have taco night with canned meat. Canned meat is still around right now on certain products. Uh, spam can save your life. Uh, there's other great ways to, you know, mix, you know, eggs, rice. Um, you know, you can take a basic whey powder that has no taste, and you can put in your soup for a thickening agent, or something like that, and you'll have your protein, and then it, it has no taste to it. So you use that as a thickening agent, and it has protein in it. You know, you can do a lot of stuff. Uh, you can get oatmeal cookie at bodybuilding.com. has a bodybuilding uh, whey shake that tastes like oatmeal cookies. So, you know, it has a whole bunch. They have birthday cake. They have all that the, all that famous uh, things you crave. And then, you get, I don't like the birthday cake. I like the oatmeal cookies, and I love their vanilla, and I love their strawberry. I'm not a big fan of the chocolate. The chocolate's just usually the same in all of them. I like vanilla, strawberry, um, and I do like the oatmeal cookie one. But just start uh, getting some of those stuff going and uh, stock up some whey powder like I did. Uh, it doesn't really go that bad. And just if it's sealed and have an oxygen uh, absorber in it, yeah, it lasts you a long time. And until next time, ladies and gentlemen, make sure you aim for the fences and you can achieve anything. Talk to you later.